you're chilling with your high school peeps. I'm your girl Tanya Masipa and this is High School Talk. High school is one of the most important parts of our life, but before we get right there, don't go anywhere, we'll be right back. Welcome back to High School Talk. Today we have the beautiful and lovely Ndombufuti Abrokwa. Ndombufuti, how are you doing today? I'm fine, thanks. And you? I'm good. I'm very eager to know what is your involvement with our school? Um, part of the SGB at the PFN Reinefeld High School in Kempton Park. So people out there who don't know what SGB is, can you please explain to us what is that? Um, SGB is the school governing body. We are a group of parents who forms a committee aimed at promoting the well-being and the effectiveness of the school community. We are doing it voluntary. We're not getting any salary for that. We are just doing it for the love of our community, the love of the school and the love of our children. So that's what um, SGP is all about. Oh, so SGP revolves like around parents. It's mostly parents, part of your SGB members. It, yes, it's mostly parents. So, Ntombi, tell me, how is the relationship between you and the students in Sapia? Um, the relationship is very good because they can always come to us and discuss things which they are unable to discuss with the teachers. And we also take their views, their concerns, um, when it comes to anything that has to do with the school. So we don't just shut them down, we listen to them. So we have a good relationship with, the, with our students. So are you working with the students also and then the students get to report to you guys also, other than the principal, right? No, they can, but it's like, it's like your own child. Sometimes a child cannot, cannot find it easy to voice out to 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 to, to you as a parent oh, yeah. but they can they can voice out to me maybe as an auntie or a teacher oh, other so than a parent yes that's right yes okay other than sapir what other schools have you worked out with um in my line of duty not as an sgb i've worked with most of the schools in kempton park talking about Global College, Oxford High School, Spartan High School, Rosefield High School, Shangri-La High School, and many more. Now, okay, what is the main purpose of SGB? As a member, what can you say? What do you mostly deal with? The challenges that we, we deal with mostly, um, it will be drugs for now. And then how do you solve such drugs in the school? How do you even find the drugs? Um, with the assistance of other stakeholders like uh, South African Police Service, they assist us with the sniffing dogs. So through conducting search using the, the sniffing dogs, that's how we, we, we get at the drugs. But with some of the students, some of them, they come out when they need help. Mm -hmm. So that's how we, we get the information. Yeah, because now we know that high school kids are a lot of trouble. So do you actually make them away when you come into search or you just come out of nowhere? No, we do not make them away because obviously if we make them aware, they are not going to bring anything on that day. Definitely, they will hide it. Yes. Before, before that, so you do searches in your schools. So like the type of communication that you have with the kids, is it based on only school things or also what they face at home? Um, there's a component that is called social crime prevention in the South African Police Service, which deals with all the social related problems in our community. So they, they do school talks based on what the school based on, on what the school is going through. If they are going through bullying, they will come and do a talk about bullying. If it's an issue of drugs, obviously they will get um, an expert who knows more about drugs to come and give a, 
safety tips about drugs. Wow, that's a lovely job you're doing for our students. Don't go anywhere, we'll be right back. Watching high school talk. Ndombi, we were talking about problems and challenges that the students are facing, mm -hmm. and also we got solutions. So, I would love to know what do you think, actually, in your own opinion, is the cause of students taking drugs? Um, I think it will be uh, some, it could be situations at home, definitely, um, peer pressure. Mm -hmm wanting to belong into a certain group so obviously you would want to do what they are doing so if they are taking substance abuse you would take sus substance abuse in, the in order yeah, for yeah. you to belong into uh, into that particular group and also not um, being involved in any activities like soccer or dance or anything that sports. can keep our youth busy yeah, like that sports. can be a, a cause for them to take substance abuse that's definitely true so if a student came to you as an sgp member and had a problem do you solve it yourself or you first take it to the principal um it depends um in most cases we would um, inform the school and the school will inform the parents um, and then after informing the parents there's an office um, under social crime prevention mm -hmm. at our nearest police station which is called victim empowerment center where where um, the victims are referred to so normally with the permission of the parents we would refer the the child together with the parent at the Victim Empowerment Center. Oh, so these are clubs or let's say groups, social groups that you can refer them to that, right? It's an office based at a police station, at the nearest police station, which deals with victims oh, okay. of all sorts of um, oh, that's right. problems. Okay, to the students out there who are watching, what advice would you give to them as a member of SGB? My, my advice will be they should stay away from drugs focus on their studies and find something to do something to keep them busy it can be dance soccer any activity they must they should find something that they love and and do it to keep themselves busy and they should always stay as assertive be positive things Ye will go well yes well thank you Ndomi, for your lovely presence i enjoyed talking to you today and thank you viewers for watching don't forget to subscribe on our youtube channel aus media and press post notification to know when we're dropping any episode see you next time